Hi, I'm Kate Byfield, and this is your Art Speak Studio Moment. Today we're going to do a little scientific experiment. We are going to compare paints that have been allowed to dry in the palette, and then we re-wet with a sprayer, whether those colors that we get out of that are just as intense as fresh squeezed paint. The reason we're doing this is because a lot of my students tell me that their other teachers have told them in the past that you always must squeeze fresh paint into your palette every time you paint. And I don't do that. So maybe I'm wrong. Let's see. Okay, so this is my palette and the paints that are in there have been in the wells for quite a long time. And all I do when I get ready to paint is just spray them with the spray bottle so that they're a little bit moist when I go in to get the color. Let's see what happens. I take a little bit of ultramarine blue out of the well, add some water to it, and apply it to the paper. And the other color that we're going to use for comparison is cadmium yellow. So here's my cadmium yellow. I mix up a little puddle of it in the mixing area and I'm applying it to the paper. No fresh paint. Okay, so here's another palette. I'm going to squeeze out some ultramarine blue so that it's fresh and some cadmium yellow. And I take the paint, mix a little puddle as I always do, get it the right consistency, and I'm going to paint the paper. Now for the, the cadmium yellow. I don't see a lot of difference between them when they're wet, Let's see what happens when they dry. I'm not seeing a lot of difference between the dry paint and the freshly squeezed paint in terms of the saturation on the paper. The reason other artists give for why they use fresh paint every time is because they say they can get better color, more saturated colors, and that they don't wear out their brushes as fast by not trying to scrape up dry paint. I'm not finding either one of those uh, arguments very persuasive. I don't use freshly squeezed paint because for me, fresh paint is more difficult to handle. I know how much water I need to add to get the right amount of uh, paint versus water to get my paints to go on and get the value that I want them to be using dry paints. I do not know how to do that as well with fresh squeeze paints, and so fresh squeeze paints add a problem for me. The other thing is that if you have to squeeze fresh paint out every single time, you waste a lot of paint, which is more expensive. I also do some traveling and I take my standard palette with me, and I've got, if I've got freshly squeezed paints in the palette, they will run more than dry paints will. And I don't like having cadmium red all over everything else in my suitcase. So the controversy about whether to use freshly squeezed paints every time or whether to just re-wet dry paints is entirely up to you. I don't see a real difference between the saturation that I get in the paints or the colors. Um, you may find it different, you should check it out for yourself. In the meantime, I wish you happy painting and I hope to see you again on another Art Speak Studio moment. Bye.